it's November 13th. This is the BAM Weekly Muni Market Update. I'm here with Dan Bingham and Chris Flossie from BAM's Capital Markets Desk. Thanks for being here, gentlemen. Okay. Um, Dan, let's start with you. Uh, it was a shortened week with the Veterans Day holiday in the middle of the week, uh, and we started with a, a big uptick in yields as a result of uh, new news on vaccine effectiveness. How did that play out over the course of the week? Sure. The, I guess the two big news cycles uh, continue to be the election and the virus. On the election front, um, we continue to work through um, the uh, finality of it um, and uh, whether the acceptance is, is, is acknowledged or not, um, which continues to take a lot of the uh, uh, headline news uh, articles. Um, from the virus, we saw cases tick up over 100,000 and, and continue to climb, and it seems like um, uh, various municipalities are taking more aggressive steps. We saw Chicago go into complete lockdown again and various other uh, places instituting more restrictions. How this evolves is certainly on everyone's mind. Um, with that, we saw we did see a uh, rallying treasuries and a selling off of, of uh, equities as, uh, as the week progressed and treasuries ending uh, 10 year treasuries at 88 basis points and uh, 30 year treasuries at 163. Um, the municipal market has been fairly stable through this period. I think a combination of a, um, uh, the heavy calendar that we saw ebbed a lot, as you say, uh, a little bit of the vacation week this week, 3.3 billion of issuance. Um, we did see inflows of 1.2 billion this week, which continues to put a pretty good uh, support into the market. In fact, um, uh, BlackRock's ETF, um, the largest ETF, over 18 billion, had record inflows um, on Thursday this week. So we continue to see pretty good uh, support for municipals uh, across the spectrum. And with that, we're seeing pretty good stability in municipals. We saw a 10-year uh, mostly unchanged at 83 basis points, was up one basis point over the week, and 30-year MND coming in at 157 unchanged on the week. Um, and importantly, the, the uh, metric people look at uh, being ratios, 10-year uh, and 30-year ratios are at 93% and 96%. So Chris, let's turn to you. Uh, looking over at the primary market last week uh, was just under $4 billion. That's going to ramp back up to a more normal run rate of uh, just under $10 billion in the coming week. What kind of activity are you looking at? So, so far, there's roughly $150 million of BAM insured paper slated to price. Uh, two transactions we want to highlight are a $36 million Reading, Pennsylvania transaction that RBC will price. There's also a $30 million Martinez USD California transaction that DA Davidson priced. And that, that deal will be backed by unlimited tax general obligation. And Chris, obviously there are additional transactions we're waiting on and the underwriters are waiting on to see if the uh, late week rally in mini yields holds. And so uh, some of those refunding transactions that are more rate sensitive may come into the market. Correct. We're waiting to see if some of the, the refunding transactions are more viable and give enough savings to the issuer so that they can price and get the better rates for the, for the, for the issuer. And one of the largest of those transactions now expected to come to market next week is a combined $115 million new money and refunding bond issue for the Paramount Unified School District in California in Los Angeles County. That's going to be priced by Piper. And Shelby Schwabauer from BAM's Los Angeles office has a BAM Credit Insights video on that transaction that uh, people can view on our YouTube page. market is unpredictable, BAM gives you certainty. In the face of market volatility and illiquidity, BAM insured municipal bonds deliver default protection, value preservation, and a durable AA rating from S&P. BAM's insurance protects against everything that causes a default, and adding BAM insured municipal bonds to your portfolio is easy. Talk to your investment advisor, visit buildamerica.com, or look for BAM eligible bonds on the Perform Portfolio Management System. BAM. Build America Mutual.